Welcome to your ePortfolio adventure. An ePortfolio will allow you to showcase your work for a variety of audiences, your instructors, your classmates, and maybe even potential employers. Google Sites offer an ePortfolio system that's pretty easy to use and maintain. Let's get started by creating a site and then setting it up to share it with your instructor and classmates. To begin creating your Google Site ePortfolio, first log into your campus Gmail account then follow these instructions to create your site and share it with others from SOU. First, click on the Apps block up in the upper right corner of your email page. When the application tiles are displayed, click on Sites to display the Google Sites page. When you create a site, you have the choice of creating it from scratch or using a template to create your site. We'll be using a template for SOU ePortfolio sites. Your instructor will notify you of the template that you should use as a basis for your site. Click on the Create button. Now you need to search the template gallery to find the template you need to use for your ePortfolio. Click on the box labeled Browse the Gallery for More to bring up the template that your instructor has designed for you to use. Scroll down the list of SOU templates until you locate the template designated for your course or program. If you don't see the template, enter its name in the Search Gadget fields here and click on the Search icon. To show you how this works, I'm going to select the SOU Black and Red template. Once you click on a template to select it, this Select a Site Template confirmation page will appear. Click on Select. You'll find yourself back on the Create Sites page, and this time, the template that you have selected will be singled out with a red box around it. Verify that the selected template is, in fact, the one you want to use. For me, that's the SOU Black and Red template. Name your site by entering your name, first and last, in the field provided. So, for my site, I'm going to use Rocky Raider 2, and then click on Create Site. Stand by while your site is created. This will take a few minutes. Don't panic. As soon as your site has been created, you need to adjust the share settings. This is an important step because Google Sites are set up so that anyone at SOU can edit any new site, and you probably aren't ready to have all of us mess around in your site. Once your site appears, then click on the blue Share button in the upper right-hand corner. In the Share Settings page, click on the link labeled Change. Click the radio button in front of People at SOU with the link option. Below that, you'll find the Access type and choose use this pull-down menu to change it to Can View. Click on Save. Once you have saved your share settings, you can verify who has access to your site and what rights they have access to. So in this case, people at SOU who have the link can view. You'll also see a link to share field. This is your site's URL. Copy this link so that you can share it with your instructor and classmates as instructed. To return to your ePortfolio homepage, click on your name here on the left. Congratulations, you've created a site for your ePortfolio. 